So today's video is about the RF choke and the relocation of my antenna. Uh, two days ago, I was talking to Golf Whiskey Zero Sierra Sierra India and India Whiskey Zero Golf Yankee Victor and also Lima Alpha One Tango. And unbeknown to me, I had RF come back into the shack and as I do my audio processing via the PC and external sound card, the RF that came back into the shack, it turned off my sound card. I lost the sound card drivers and I didn't know at the time I was recording a video for YouTube and I didn't know until editing the videos that that happened. So I will show you snippets of, of the audio and the conversations we had as well. Uh, but on this one, uh, we had to uh, address the issue. So we built this choke. Now, I didn't do a video on, on how I built it. I'd forgotten to get the camera out at the time. Uh, but this one is a 240-43 uh, tool ride and uh, 17 turns of RG58. And the where I got it from, uh, the information that where I'd got it from was from G3TXQ. Uh, it's, it's well known. And here is the screenshot. Have a weatherproof box to put it in. We're going to put it in this. The dimensions are 85 by 150 by 53 millimeters. As you can see, it fits nice and snug. Inside, we'll also fasten it down with some cable ties if we can. If not, we'll get some, uh, some little bit of glue, something to, to hold it in place. But it is pretty in there as it is at the moment. Now you can see we have drilled the holes to go through and we're going to put them in place now. Right, now we have them fitted. We can now stick the, uh, the core in and attach the, the coax to the ends of the plugs. Just give you a quick look. And now we'll get the plugs, the core onto the plugs. And here we have it all soldered onto the plugs. It's in there nice and firmly. Which I give you a nice closer look. I'm not the best solderer, but it is nicely soldered. And here we have it finished. Let's go and Connect it all together and put it on the shack wall nice and neatly. And here we have it all finished. Just got to put the cover on and job done. I shall now show you snippets of what the sound used to sound like with the RF coming into my audio.
CQ, CQ, CQ40. Mike, zero, kilo, November, Mike. Mike, zero, kilo, November, Mike. Mike, zero, kilo, November, Mike. Calling CQ and standing by. Italy, uniform, eight kilo, Radio Yankee. Uh, Radio Yankee again, please. Italy Uniform 8, Kilo Romeo Yankee. Thank you for the contact. You are, uh, I would say, 4 and 7. 4 and 7, over. Yes, Martin. Thank you. It's 5 7, 5 8 for Sub Italy. My name is Antonio. My city is Napoli. Napoli. Back to you, Martin. Thank you for the 5 by 8. 5 by 8. I've got that. My name is, uh, as you know, Martin, and uh, the radio we're using today is the uh, Yaesu FT840, uh, doing approximately 100 watts uh, out the back of the radio, uh, going into a N-fed half wave on uh, on an inverted V, uh, approximately 10 meters uh, to the apex of the uh, of the house. Uh, my audio is processed via the PC. And uh, that is done via the PC and an external sound card. Uh, over. Okay, Martin, Mike, zero kilo, November, Mike, uh, returning uh, Italy, uniform, eight kilo, Romeo, Yankee. My name is Antonio. Yes, uh, good, good station, Martin, good station. Uh, okay, my station is Cambridge, uh, Cambridge, uh, Tango Sierra, 850, uh, 100 baht. Uh, one, uh, my antenna is uh, one dipole, one dipole for my, ga my garden. Uh, I think so, 10 meters, 10 meters for my garden. Uh, Martin, okay, back to you. Uh, roger, 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 all confirmed, all confirmed. Uh, it's doing well, it's doing well. Uh, I didn't, uh, wasn't sure about the, uh, the band conditions tonight, but... I, uh, I'm going to have a little go. I'm actually uh, doing a uh, YouTube video. I'm uh, recording a YouTube video uh, for my for my channel. Um, so if you uh, if if you look on my QRZ, there is a link to my YouTube channel, and uh, it will later on uh, in the next uh, day should be uh, should be posted up uh, over. The propagation very very easy, very very easy. I copy you uh, just a little, just a little, Roger. Uh, Roger, Roger, Roger. Yes, it's the same this end. It is the same this end. I have uh, QSB uh, my end 
and also QRM. I have uh, at least a uh, uh, SS uh, signal seven, signal seven of uh, of of band noise over. Over, over, yes. Yeah. So you five by seven and five by eight. Uh, but because the propagation too much, it will be very, very problem for me for listen. Okay, my friend uh, Martin, no problem. I send you the my my call, the my query data. It's come. Okay. Thank you, Martin. Mike zero kilo. India, Uniform 8 Kilo Romeo Yankee, uh, my name is Antonio, thank you for contact, uh, 73 and you and your family, uh, happy new year. Thank you my friend, thank you very very much, uh, sorry because too much question be, okay, bye bye. Thank you very much, yes there is, thank you very much, uh, 73. Mike zero kilo November Mike. Mike zero kilo November Mike. You five and nine. Thanks for the five and nine. You are also five and nine. Over. Roger. QSL on the contact. Old man seventy three. Thank you. Seventy three. Two hundred forty Zulu three six Tango. Mike zero kilo November Mike. Two hundred again. Mike zero kilo November Mike. Yeah, Mike Zero Kilo November Mike QSL. Okay, Mike Zero Kilo November Mike. You're five and nine. Thank you. Thank you for the five nine. You are four four nine four nine with a QSM. Your QSM, yeah. Zero three six Tango. Sorry, Q R M. What should I say? Zero Right, this is where I've relocated my antenna. It's so approximately the transformer is about eight meters up high, and then we can see the cable comes all the way across and down over there. We'll go over there in just a second. And also, I've put a 17 foot counterpoise on it um, just in case. Um, I'm still experimenting with, uh, with tuning the aerial. So as you can see, it comes down here to the back of the garden and at the moment we're doing experimental, experimental and goes across there. We've just got to tune in. Not sure whether to, to put it up a little bit and let it hang down or not. Uh, this one is a, an old DX commander pole that broke and I got a replacement off him is why at the moment it's got uh, tape around it so that concludes our video for today please thumbs up if you like the video thumbs down if you dislike the video subscribe if you haven't subscribed already also hit that bell icon to be notified for when i do future videos Thank you for watching.